ram rambling rambling Pete hey Pete rambling Pete 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 Pete, Pete, Pete. <sighs> what's he got he's got this idea in his head about how to do so many things at once it's so many ideas coming in at the same time and he has difficulty getting it out there it's like a big pie basically reinventing life um, so the idea is that there are lots of water 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 lots of water water i'm from nah actually the island um and to see things floating on this body of water so i see these starting from a small scale model of just this sort of bubble that sits on the water, rises up, and has this extension that comes off of it. That's what I would see if I was looking for something floating on the water. Um, and how to make this bubble that things would be able to grow up on it, and off it, and in it. Um, so there's basically just a surface that the sun and the water and it creates this armature that things can grab onto um, I see I don't know just lots of ways that you would be able to create the surface where things can grow on and in um, on the inside so there is a skin that has a void and ways that the you don't know you don't know you just don't know but I'm working on it and the idea is that there's this material out there that can be created from waste products um, there is an enormous amount of plastic film waste that there's not a market for um, and it all depends upon how expensive it costs to take fresh oil out of the ground, crack it, and a lot of them, when they crack it, they get fuel, they get lots of amazing things out of this oil. Um, and part of it is, like, it's not all great stuff. So they've been finding uses, and they've created plastic from a lot of what they get out of a cracked barrel of oil. Um, a lot of his byproducts that they didn't know what to do with and so hey you know what we can do so it's in their interest to find a market for this so that said let's just get on with the situation is there's lots of it out there and they're making lots more of it um, it's here not saying just sit back and enjoy it but we got to do something with it um, and I see a large-scale installations where these bubbles are created and there's some perforations um, there's light coming through it's not just this giant mass of structure it's growing um, and it's interacting with the environment so you have light coming through you have shading you have plants growing you have you know all this aquatic growth and so forth 